hello everyone there's another new video we are coming with guys uh, so guys I'm going to show you for the gamers so so when we download files so we will have the files like this like iso files so these are these are file images so we can't run the setup from this without mounting this this image to the virtual driver so in this video we are going to show you how to create virtual driver and how to mount this this image then how to access this this image files easily so there's plenty of ways to do this but in this case I'm going to show you guys software let me show you power ISO it's a very powerful tool so you can buy this tool if you like it so you can try it if, before you buy it. okay so you in this uh, main features you can see you can uh, make mount any these images and you can uh, extract and you can rip you can burn so there is many features in the software now I'm going to download this application it's free to try so you guys you can free to try if you like you can buy okay guys now I'm going to download this application so when you're downloading make sure that your Windows version is 32 bit or 64 bit so in this case my windows version is windows 10 it's 64 bit so i'm going to use 64 bit version okay guys if you are using uh, 32 bit you can go with the 32 bit version so how do you know is your windows version is 32 bit or 64 bit in this case i'm going to show you quickly guys go to your my computer go to the properties in this case you can see system type you can see there are 64 bit operating system so if your system is 32 bit it will show system type is 32 bit or 64 bit so it's a quick tip to how to find 64 bit or 32 bit okay guys let's back to the website now i'm going to download this file okay guys now i'm going to download it it's it's not a big file it's only 4 mb okay now it's download completed now I'm going to open that file okay now so you can see the agreement say agree so installation path I'm, I'm not going to uh, do anything I'll just install it's done next so there is file association so you can select what type of files you can delete so you can select all or you can isolate your selection it's up to you so in this window you can see there is a virtual drive so you can have virtual drive so in that virtual drive we can mount that CD image to it and open it like a normal CD to our own okay so in this case I'm going to use only one driver so you can use any drivers it's up to you so I'm going to close it okay installation is done still you can't see any virtual driver so I need to reboot my PC to show up my virtual driver okay we are back in okay now we can see how's going on so now we can see in our computer there is a virtual drive so you can see there's a CD drive it's a virtual driver so now you can mount that image file to this virtual drive it's very easy it's very easy so guys now right click go to the power ISO so you can see mount image to drive so guys click on it now you can browse your location the file location so in this case there is a game file so it's an ISO file you can see 
so I'm going to select that file select open now you can see that file is mounted to that virtual drive so you can open it so there's files on that virtual drive so like that way you can mount it any base images through this virtual driver it's very useful so if you want to unmount that so you if you want to mount it another one so you can do it like this right click on it so you can go to the power iso you can see unmount drive so you can unmount it that base image file so it will clear out that this image file so guys i hope you guys if this video is help you to uh, something uh, so most of gamers will download the files so they will get these images in some files not only the games some software maybe so you can mount it on your virtual driver so then you can use it very easily so uh, in this software just only mounting guys so you can make your own this image if you want to so it's very useful software power iso you can see on your software tray so so you can open it your power iso software so in this case you can see it's trial version i'm using to show you this feature so you can see there is many options so you can burn in features you can compress you can copy you can mount in so there's many features so we will come on another video there's uh, on features so guys i hope you this video will help you so see you on another video peace